Hey guys, me again. I can't believe that he actually bought another house. I had no idea any of this was going to happen. I had no idea that he was even planning on getting a second house. I've never heard him talk about it. And it happened like so quickly. I mean, we just broke up. I feel like it wasn't even that long ago. Like how, I didn't know you can buy a house that soon. So yeah, Jeffrey was useless. No information from him. I feel like the next best thing to do is to talk to his parents. Hopefully his parents would be nicer about this. Hopefully they'll tell me where he's at. I, I saw that they've been there. They know exactly where the house is. So hopefully they'll help me. Obviously in my car, I'm about to head over to their house, see what they have to say, and hopefully they'll help me out. All right guys, I just got here. Um, I never really showed up unannounced before. So hopefully they won't be like too worded out or angry that I'm doing this, but we'll see. We will see. I guess I'll just park over right here. Look like they're home, so. All right, here goes nothing. I hear the dogs, so I guess they're here. Like I said, I never showed up like this, so hopefully like it's not too awkward. I'm actually really nervous. Okay. For Jesse, do you know where he's at? You're looking for Jesse. Yes. I asked I asked Jeffrey where he was. He Did wasn't home. Jesse? No, I, I kinda wanted to just like show up. I I, I don't know, I, I really need to talk to him. Well, I mean you come in here and you have a camera. Yeah. You're videoing. I yeah, see, well, I've watched your videos. You did? Yes. And I I I'm not gonna lie, I'm very disappointed. And what you had to say, and and you want me to tell you where Jesse is? Yeah, I mean, I I was disappointed in what he had to say, so I I had to stand up for myself. Okay, I know that's between you two. Whatever your problems are, and I I know what you said. I'm not going to get into that. But mm -hmm. he comes to your house to give yeah. you your phone that you won, yeah. and you allow your father to embarrass him well, and I, kick I him had, out and you stand there and you film it with a camera that well, actually I had, looks like one of Jesse's. Did you take that when you left? No, I had no idea that was going to happen and Nick was filming too. So either way, like if I didn't film it, it was filmed and he still put it up. Okay, but you didn't speak up. You just let your dad kick him out. You well, know how embarrassing yeah, that must have been? I know. And, and, I, and how I, he probably felt. I know, and I want to see him, and I want to apologize for that. Uh, I didn't know all that was going to happen. Like, it just exploded. Well, if, if, did you try, you tried to talk to him? Yeah, I mean, well, I haven't, yeah. like, reached out, but, like, I, I want to go see him. Apparently, he's at this new house. I feel like if I talk to him in person, it would be better than, like, calling or texting. And I thought, I thought you said it would be a good idea for us to talk, and I feel I, like... I do think it's it's the best idea for you to talk. Yeah, so I, I'm looking for him. Like, do you know the I coordinates or where the house is? I, I, I saw you were I there. I can't tell you, if he wants to talk to you, maybe he needs a little time right now. If he wants to talk to you, he will tell you where he is. So, either you text him, I, I, I wouldn't, I'm not going to give you any information about where he is. Really? I can't do it. I can't do it. Well, I I, I want to make this work, and I and I want to fix things. I thought you would help me fix this. Well, then you have to figure it out on your own how to do it. You have to figure out. You have to keep contact him. Show him you care because evidently he thinks you don't care. Yeah. I mean, if he's not answering answering anything from you, then he, he's he he probably needs time to think. Mm -hmm. Um and. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you, Ash. I, I, don't, like, I don't know either. I, I'm, I'm trying to fix this. And I want, and nobody's I want helping me. Yeah, and nobody's helping me. Like, it's, it's not like Jesse to be 
um, like, you know, not wanting you to do the best thing for yourself. That's yeah. how it was for everybody. And so, I, yes, you just definitely need to communicate. But I cannot tell you where he is. He has to be the one to tell you. It's, that's, I'm sorry, but that's all I can do. All right. Just, you guys, you guys got to, I don't know. I can't, I don't want to be involved. Yeah. Uh, but I, I do want you guys to work it out. Mm hmm Okay. All right, well. Um, I wish you luck. All right, I'm sorry for just barging in. Okay. I don't mean to be really short with you or, or testy, but as a mother, it, it, it bothered me to hear you say those things about my son, and it bothered me to watch somebody throwing him out of the house and you just standing there and watching it. And so, I mean, it just bothers me, so that's why I'm. I don't want to be that way, but okay. you know, it's yeah. It's okay. I mean, I get it. I get it's it. It's okay. I, I want you guys to work it out. I want you to talk. Okay. So, okay. but you got to do it on your own. I don't. I don't care how you do it. Just you know, just be extra. Um, I don't pursue him. Pursue him because maybe maybe he he needs that. Yeah. You okay. Know? All right. Okay. Thank you. Alright, good luck, honey. Thanks. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, wait. The garage light's on. Maybe Jeff's in there. Let me check. Oh, gosh. Oh. It looks like he's in there. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna talk to him. Maybe he'll give it to me. Maybe he'll help me out in this situation because nobody's helping me. I don't know what else to do. All I wanted to do was talk to him and nobody's helping me. Hello? Anyone in here? Hey Ash, what are you doing here? Hey, I'm 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 looking for Jesse. Do you know where he is? Well, I haven't seen him for a while. Why'd you ask him? Well, I, I asked Jeffrey and he said he moved. Um so and I saw you guys were at like a new house. I didn't know that was real. So I'm I'm just trying to find out the address to the house so I can go talk to him. Well that's something you gotta iron out with him. I'm not betraying my son, you know, and I'm not going to get any details of what you guys been through. I have no parts of that. I know, but like, no, nobody's helping me, and I'm trying to fix this. Well, I, I can't help you. I, I, I got to back my son on this one. Look what he did for me. Nice, nice thing. Gave me a new car. Something I've always wanted. Yeah. I, can't, I can't go against what he wants. If he wanted to tell you, it's up to him to tell you. Well, and what are you going to do? Figure out and apologize to him for your dad grabbing him by the pants and throwing him out of the house? How come he didn't stick up for him then? Well, I, that was my dad. I'm not going to go against my dad. But you're his daughter. You should have stuck up for him. I know. Okay, yeah, and I, and I told him that was wrong. Well, and and I, I didn't. got problems. You guys work it out. Your dad shouldn't have manhandled my kid and threw him out of the house. Yeah, I know. And I, I, and I want to apologize for that. But I, I didn't know that was going to happen. Well, I didn't know it was going to happen. Why didn't you apologize that day? That was, that's what, that was what you should have done. It probably would have never escalated I know. at this point. I know. And I, and I regret that. But, like, Nick was filming it, too. And it just it did get out of hand. It did. But I, I, I don't know. I'm just trying to look for him, and nobody's telling me where where his new house is. Like, why did he get a new house? I'm not going to get involved. I'm not going to answer it. That's something you've got to figure out and find out on your own. Because I don't know if if he doesn't want you to know where it is, and then I went and told you stuff. I said then the trust level for me and him would be out. I can't I can't lose that. Yeah, I but really can't. yeah, but don't you want us to fix this? Like this is oh, helping wanna, me I fix wanna, this. I want it fixed. I really do. I hate the controversy. I really do. And I don't want yeah. I don't want people being put, you know, me against him, me against you, things like that cuz I, I don't want any parts of that. I want everything to work out for everybody, but I don't be the want to be the one to tell you where he is. If he wants you to know where he is, he'll tell you. That's the best I can tell you. I can't give you any more than that. Right. I hope it works out, but I won't betray my son. That's one thing I won't do. Well, I, I don't know who else to go to. I mean, your wife won't tell me. Jeffrey won't tell me. You won't tell me. I like I don't. I guess I'll just keep. I can't help trying, you. I really but can't. 
Mm -hmm. I feel for the situation, but I don't. <sighs> okay. I'm sorry. I don't know what else to tell you. I just. All right. Well, good luck. All right. All right. Thank you. Uh huh. <sighs> oh, God. This is so ridiculous. And so embarrassing. I probably should not have come here. I should have known that they've seen the video of them getting kicked out. I should have known that they would be mad about it. I didn't know that they were going to be this mad. I'm going to stop right here. I'm going to talk to you guys. I don't think you can see that I'm still in the driveway. That was so embarrassing. Like, to just show up. I thought just showing up like this would show them and prove to them that I'm serious about this. Like, I want to fix this and I want to find him and I want to apologize and everything, but I don't know if they don't care or... I know that, I know they're sticking up for Jesse and they're, they're trying to help him because he's hurt, but I'm also hurt too in this situation and I thought they would help me want to fix this. I'm like, I'm like shaking right now. I, that was so... It's not what I was expecting. I thought they would want to help me, especially his mom. His mom's always been so nice to me. Always been willing to help me with everything. And I, I don't know. Oh, gosh. And for her to say, like, with the whole camera and YouTube and everything, like, I, I know I hurt him, but he also hurt me too. And that's why we just need to talk. And I just need to see him. And I just, it would be so much better if I did it in person than over text or any call. Let me know guys like in the comments like what I should do now. Like this video. I only know maybe like one other person that can help me in this situation. This person is my last resort. Let me know your thoughts down below. I read all the comments. I've been listening to you guys. I know you said I should like talk to him and everything. And I'm really, I'm really trying. I'm really trying to get to him. If you guys can, you know, find anything out or let me know where he is. Please let me know in the comments. I'll pick this up soon. Bye guys.